Okay, and we are back with some more Newfound Courage, Chapter 2. Uh, for some reason, I thought there were four chapters in this, but I guess not. I might just be uh, uh, hallucinating Chapter 4. Uh, let's continue, shall we? Uh, so we last left off uh, with Raiko going through a mysterious door and us trying to find a puzzle for it, and we solved the puzzle relatively quick. Even though it took me like five tries because I'm an idiot and can't count. Uh... It's not there. If it's not in Podium, the room should have split apart. Something's terribly wrong. Raiko, we totally had to save you. We... What's wrong? It can't be. Um... Bye? Alexander, I need you... He prefers Alex. Jake, be quiet. Alex, I need you to run as fast as you can to Nora's house. Find her and bring the safe book the safe book of safety back with you. Or or just bring the book, I don't mind. I have a bad feeling. A really bad feeling. Find Nora. Yes, ma'am. Yes, sir. I really need to add that meme to my uh, fucking uh uh <laughs> downloaded stuff. I love using it at work, it's great. I'm running! I'm running as fast as I can! Nora? She's gone. I have to find the book. What was that? No, you son of a bitch. The safe book of safety. Why is it here? I better get back to the vault. I want a room like this. That should do it. It worked. Thanks, Alex. Phew. What do you mean, phew? You weren't sure it would work. Don't worry about it. It's fine. But do worry about this. I need you to go and get Stanley's book. We need to keep it safe. If people are disappearing, I need to check on my sister. She might be young, but she's perfectly capable of looking after herself. Hm. You should find me when you get a chance, Alex. I'll be on the other side of the vault. Jake, that's in, that's in an out-of-bounds area. Are you sure he's ready? Of course, Alex is smart. I mean, he saved us. That's true. Alex, you're now free to move about the vault as you please. But be careful. You better go, Jake. Okay, but Alex, don't forget. Uh, journal updated. Wait a minute. Alex, where's Nora? I couldn't find her. That's strange. Look, I'm sure she's just gone for a walk or something. Why don't you check with the town folk to see if they've if anyone's seen her? Uh, aren't you worried? She used to disappear all the time. Although, I'll admit, it's been a while. Regardless, you better check if anyone's seen her. Are you going to tell me another... Uh, are you going to tell me what an other where is going on? I'll let you know when I know. Now, I have a bone to pick with our vault keeper. Okay. So, we're going to go check out the town. See if anybody's seen anything. And then we're going to go meet up with Jake. Actually, let me drop a save real quick. It's been a oh, I've not played this since October of last year, so that's great. 
which is totally okay. Yeah, but yeah, I love this game. It's one of my favorite games. The soundtrack is nice. Here we go. Oh, hello. How can I help you? Peggy, do you know who I am? You're Raiko's guardian. So you don't remember. I I have to... What a strange person. Okay, we're going to check in the pub real quick first. God, there's nobody here. Alexander, what are you doing here? Where's Jake? He's in the vault and... Have you seen Nora? No, I haven't. She's gone missing again, has she? Yeah. I see. Well, I'll go look in the regular spots. Don't worry. We'll find her. Ooh, wait, hold on. I think this is Jake's room. Jake lights cricket, too. I swear I'm addicted to these things. There's a message written on the whiskey bottle. Happy 18th birthday, Jake. You can drink legally now. Oh, I can't sleep in his bed? That's whack. Enter and I will destroy you, Sienna. Too much junk. That's not. Okay, so... How much do you know about eggs? Oh, um, the normal amount? Typical. Another casual. Anyway, I sell jerky. <laughs> Come back when you're an egg expert. Uh, I hate you so fucking much. Who's a good boy? Yes, you are. Okay, you can't go in there yet. I'll check in with uh, Peggy in a bit. Let me go down here and check on these three. Locked. It's a painting of Marge and Heather. They look happy. Uh, okay, so... Useless. Come on, Mr. Stanley, sir. Stanley, are you okay? Oh, Alexander, mate. I'm fine. I just can't turn around right now because... Um... I've got hay fever, that's it. Are you crying? Of course not, although I'd be perfectly fine if I were, you know. What can I help you with? I swear to God, I love this game. Okay, so that's two people asked. I don't think Heather's back yet. Yeah, no. Okay, we can go ask Peggy. Oh, it's you, the new kid. Alexander, isn't it? They don't always knock in other word, do they? My name is Peggy. I'm an explorer. Well, I guess retired explorer now. It's nice to meet you, Peggy. You too. Have you seen Nora today? Who's Nora? You don't know Nora? She lives by the beach. Oh, of course. No, I haven't seen her. Although, I heard her putting lanterns in the river again last night. I'm sorry, Nora. I gotta be nosy. Map of Otherware. Okay, so not over here. Not over here. Try to check the house again just to be safe. Not over here. Hmm. I really hope they don't get this way. Yeah, same. How many people have asked?
Okay. <laughs> I vaguely recall this. Oh, this is neat. Wait a minute. Is that propeller going faster all of a sudden? Okay, we got another lore book. Uh, yeah, I'm not reading all that again. I think if I click on this, I get teleported back, right? Yeah. So... I remember this, but I don't remember how. This way. We're gonna wait a second for this. Ba 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 ba. Lore book. Awesome. Uh, of course, what the founders... Okay, yeah. Not reading those, but if you want to, you are more than welcome to pause the video and uh, watch it. <sighs> okay, so... I don't remember... Were there people out here? That's like diabetes overload. Okay, I think I'm gonna go meet up with Jake real quick and then we'll see what happens. So I'll probably cut to us going with Jake. Here lies Heather's self in Marge's heart. Oh, hello, dear. Heather, you're not all here. I was going to say being nice. But yes, that too. Marge must be dressing up as me again. In her head, I'm much meaner than I really was. Why would she do that? The poor old duck has trouble letting go. Heather, what are you? I'm a memory, dear. Does that mean you're... Well, not necessarily, but in this case. I'm afraid so. I'm sorry. Don't be sorry, dear. It means I get to stay in this room. For as long as I want. And I'll probably want to stay for a long time. Why is that? Did you know that it's always the early morning in this room? She was night and I was day. But we could always agree on dawn. If you see her, can you let her know I'd love to see her again? Even if it's only once more. Heather is humming quietly to herself. That's sad. This makes me sad. Uh, so we're going to drop a save. Uh, da da da. Hello, sweetheart. Is she... Is she in there? She'd love to see you. 
What would you do if you were me? Well, why haven't you seen her yet? Such a simple question when you ask it. The truth is, I don't really know. We were just fighting. I don't even remember why. I suppose it's time. Alexander, I have some advice for you. Never hold a grudge against someone you love. There are no winners. Only people who lost time that would have been better spent together. You know, there's something special about you. You bring people together. I do. Have you seen Nora today, Marge? <laughs> there you go again. I haven't, sweetheart. Sorry. Hmm. I'm trying to study here. Are you standing on the chair? Who are you? The chair police? Go away, please. Have you seen Nora? Not since yesterday. Sorry. Okay, so I've asked all the people where they went. Um, I'm not going to read any of that. Lot. Oh, this is strange. What is... Hey, you're here. What is it? These shelves are normally full of books. This is very strange. Hey, where are all the books? You can talk to them? Oh, no, I can't. But I kind of just do it anyway. Oh, you look mad. Ooh. Yeah, this ending's not going to let us through. We'd better go find the missing books. Oh, it's you again. I better not find any books thrown on the floor. Oh my, what? You're real? I told you. I totally believed you. Maybe. Is it going to do something? It's probably think of a new way to get me chased. So we can get into that room. We'll get chased out. That's my read anyway. But that's Kay's office. Alex, what if there's where the missing bits are? Bingo, it tends to disappear when you're right. How odd. And convenient. It's not. That is, uh, inconvenient. You mean inconvenient, right? What'd I say? Never mind. Anyway, I know someone with the key. Is it Kay? Raiko? No, well, K, yes. No, someone else and it ain't gonna come cheap. I checked on her earlier. She's studying in that room over there. Oh, that's exciting. No, I won't say it. What won't you say? Sienna, it's essential to your schooling. How could this possibly, in any possible way, be relevant to anything? Seriously, what in other way are you ta two talking about? Sienna's learning about riddles today, and I know what riddles are, old man. And what you're talking about, they're not riddles. They're disgusting. They're... I think I might be sick. They're thinly disguised dag jokes. Oh, no. Either way, you're not leaving until, uh, until you answer one. You are mad with power. Question one. I won't answer. How do lumber jets know how many trees they've cut down? Ugh, they keep a log. Of course they fucking do. Ho ho ho. You didn't even make that up. I'm hilarious. I'm leaving now. I probably won't ever come back. I'll come with. I've got to ask you something. Want to hear another joke? No. <laughs> You still don't trust me. I'm an adult now. Don't get off topic. It's a loan, okay? It's the best key I've got, and I don't want it lost. How did you even get this? Don't ask questions you shouldn't know the answer to. Anyway, I better go back in. He'll come looking soon. 
thank you again. Remember, it's a loan. She's so angry. I love, I love it. What did it cost you? I don't want to talk about it. Let's go. The books, they're all in here. How strange. Oh no, I knew this would happen. What on earth is going on? What the? This might take a while. Did, did they put the boats back under the spider webs? It looks like it. Huh. I know you're busy looking for Nora, but would you mind helping me find this book? Don't worry, I'll help. Thanks, I really appreciate it. The book we're looking for is blue. It's called Belonging, Emmanuel. Or the Book of Belonging. The Manual Belonging? Something like that, anyway. Whoever finds it first wins. Okay. Uh, we're going to drop a quick save right here. And we're going to beat this boy to it. Myth. Ooh, that made me feel sticky. Not over here. <laughs> it's just like the Stardew Halloween maze. Oh, son of a bitch. Almost like the Stardew Halloween maze. I know there's a way back there, and I don't remember which way it is. Where are you going? Ooh. I think I spooked that one last night. Oh, for fuck's sake. That is a huge hue hole. Ooh, what have you got there? Sorry for scaring you. Ooh. A key. Can I keep this? Ooh. You're not getting the key back, buddy. I'm sorry. I did not consent to being teleported just then. At least I got the book. You got the book? I sure did. Here you go. Thanks, Alex. Now let's get out of here. Whoa. I've never seen that ladder before. What if Nora's up there? Only one way to find out. Jake, you're not about to climb that ladder, are you? Um, no? Yes, of course he wouldn't. It wouldn't be very smart to go into an unexplored area in the vault, would it? No, it wouldn't. Yeah, you never know. You might get lost. Uh, leave him alone. Watch what you say to me. The vault is mine. You are not welcome. The vault. 
The vault belongs to the town. Don't let me catch either of you near that ladder again. If I do, let's hope the consequences I bring will be the worst that you experience. Is Kay always like that? It doesn't take much to annoy her these days. But she used to be nice. Anyway, I better get this book to Raiko. There's a secret room under the stairs in the vault foyer. She told me to meet her there. Come find us when you're ready. And I will drop another save right here. If I remember correctly... I know where it should be. <clears throat> I think it is right here. That's a strange looking book. I wonder what would happen if I... A room behind a bookcase. That's not a cliche at all. Okay, yeah, let's go here. Did you find Nora? No, I didn't. No matter, she'll turn up. Jake was just telling me about the ladder you two found. And Kay's reaction when you tried to climb it. It's time I let you both in on what's going on here. I won't waste any time. The vault is a weapon. It's killed the world before. And ten years ago, it nearly did it again. What? Jake, hush. Okay, if you don't become Vault Keeper, it will go to her. You can't ask me to do this. I'm the safe keeper, Kay, and I need your help to enact that responsibility. I understand that, but what you're asking me for is betrayal. I won't do that to her. Kay, you can't allow this to happen. If she becomes a Vault Keeper, she'll find a way to overrule Nora and I. Then she'll use the vault to create more vaults. She'll keep doing it and doing it until the tools to kill the world are in the hands of every human on Earth. The cycle will begin again. The mission of Silverpine failed. She would bring the world to its final end. Maybe she's right. Maybe we are corrupt. Maybe any human should be able to use the vault. The benefits it provides are endless. The vault killed the world, Kay. You know this. Its only purpose now is to prevent another from ever being created. And we're here to make sure it never is used for that purpose. Kay, you know what's happening. We're near the end. Every second we don't act, she comes closer to taking over. You were always meant to be the vault keeper, Kay. It was always you, never her. You're the best of us. We need you. Silver Pine is run by a committee of three, each of which is given a book. When all three are gathered in this room, the vault's power can be unleashed. The Encyclopedia of Understanding. This book is given to the Vault Keeper, K. Belonging, a manual. This book is given to the People's Keeper, Stanley. The Safe Book of Safety. This book is given to the safekeeper, Nora. The sendings assist keepers with their duties. The red sendings, case sendings, they have been acting suspiciously for some time now. And after we set at the pub, and everything that's happened since. Well, my fears have been confirmed. I believe that Kay's book was taken some time ago. And whoever was threatening the town ten years ago... It scared the three keepers, Nora, Stanley, and Kate enough to use the vault. And now it's back. And we're totally unprepared. I need both of you to meet me in the foyer tomorrow. We're going to find what, what she's hiding up that ladder. Until then, stick together. That night... You know, you didn't need to walk with me back here. What? I didn't. I'm staying with you tonight. Raiko said to sit together. 
Do you always do what Raiko tells you to? Only when it's the right thing to do. Thank you. Don't thank me. I like spending time with you. By the way, does Nora have a spare bed? Jake? Yes, Alex? What if someone finds us? Finds us doing what? I feel like that's obvious. Sharing a bed. I mean, won't people think? Do you have a problem with it? Well, no, I don't. Okay, Alex, I know you're not from here. But I'm not sleeping on the floor unless I have to. I just don't have the back for it. Also, you're in Silver Pine now. People are good here. Are you sure? Of course I'm sure. Let's get some sleep. You have to help me feed them. They're judging me. Feed those endings. Do I have to? I really don't like them. Done. Thank you, Alexander. I was worried they'd eat all my biscuits. Jade's waiting for you outside. I assume I have to go up the stairs to get outside? How the fuck do I leave? Okay, I really don't know how to leave. The middle of the room, apparently. Yes, of course. One of the sendings stole my sweets. Think they were down here, mayhaps. I could be wrong. I don't really remember what happened here. What are you doing here? Very strange. I think we're having a dream. I found you. I knew you would. Why are you looking at me? I knew it when I first saw you. So I keep looking back at you to remind myself. Remind yourself of what? That we'll never be as young as we are again. You know, when I'm talking to you, it's like there's something underneath what we say. A connection we have. It's understanding that I'd wait for you. And you'd wait for me too. Like, we're in this together or something. And well, it's okay that I have nothing else. Alex, knowing you and facing forever. I just can't wait. I can't wait either. 
Aww. I feel like I'm home. You know why that is, right? Why? It's because you are here. Oh, it's because you are. I'm sorry, I can't read. I am home. Knowing you and facing forever. I just can't wait. It was a dream. Jake, wake up. With a morning breath. Oh, sorry. What is it? I'm just looking forward to today's. That's all. Okay. Me too. Later that day. Good morning, you two. Good morning. Since you're both late again, we better get to work. Ah, uh, let's empty the return spots. Somehow it's full already. Which made zero sense. Like, five people live in this town. Anyway. Jake, you go to Peggy's and get the final draft of her autobiography. What's going on? Aren't we meant to be going up the... Nope. <laughs> Don't know what you're talking about. But if it's green, it's... Anyway, let's all get to work then, shall we? Okay. Chop, chop. Why wouldn't I be? Now, before I go someplace that isn't here, Alex, one of those books needs to return to that room on to your left. Jake, give me that book you found yesterday with Alex. Okay. Let's go, quickly now. Uh, return the books from the return spots. Okay. Well, I guess we're stuck doing the same thing we did already. Nothing over here. Nothing over here. Alex, wait up. Dealing with Peggy was easier than I expected. Let me help you empty the return spots. Did Reiko tell you to do this? No, this was an independent thought. I have those sometimes. Thanks. No problem. The sooner you finish here, the better. Put those up. Put those up. Okay. I very much like the fact that there's a garden growing inside the vault. Seriously, ladders are trouble. You got that right, buddy. Oh, no, don't make me. Don't make me. I don't want to be teleported again. Uh, I found a strange book. I don't know where I'm supposed to go now. There's nothing down here. Hmm. 
I did return everything up here, right? Yes, I did. I guess maybe I am supposed to touch this again? No. Oh, I think I know where. Hold on. I'm dumb. Suddenly felt like climbing a ladder. Hmm. Hmm. I'm big dumb. I don't know why it took me that long to think of where it should, where to go. Okay, so here we go again. Didn't realize it was this easy. That was so neat. This has to be the first time you two have ever been on time to anything. Did you find the book that had the blue sending fetch? You did that? Yeah, I did. Give it to me, please. Hmm. It's like I thought. I know what's up with the ladder. If Kay doesn't want us to see it, that's what we'll do. But before I forget, Jake, take Stanley's book back. She wouldn't expect me to leave it with you. No offense. It's kind of hard not to be offended by that. Yeah, I'll take the book back. Before we go, I need to tell you both what's up there. It's a chunk of the old dead world. From the time before the time that was not counted. So things might get freaky. Now you first, Alex. Wait, isn't it weird that the sending key left is gone? Yeah, hmm. I did think I'd have to get rid of that one too. Nothing much we can do about that now. Last one up the ladder is the worst. Aw, oh, what? Well, that's not fair. These new rules are great. I really love rules. The more mundane and complicated, the better. What the flip was that? What? Who are you? You can't be here. It's against the rules. Ooh, that was fun. Excuse me. You didn't tell me I'd get sucked into some vortex. Sorry, I thought it would make a good surprise. It would have been fun if it wasn't a surprise. I bet Jake will be cross. I know. I can't wait. Excuse me. Oh, hello there. Well, it's nice to finally be noticed. Wait a minute. You're ascending. What? No, it can't be. No, Alex, it is. The original sendings were made to look like humans. Everyone thought they were super creepy. So they changed them in later models. Excuse me. Oh, and they could talk. I'm not sure why we removed that functionality. Did you just call me an outdated model? You're not outdated. You're a liar. My self-awareness chips aren't totally fried. Why am I suddenly hungry? Oh, that must be really rude. I'm so sorry. Not forgiven. You're both awful. Okay, new roll. Neither of you are allowed to talk to me. Ah, that's why we got rid of the talk functionality. Bye. What an ancient little twerp. Alex, do me a favor and break a couple of its rules. I heard that. Break some rules. I am always down for breaking rules. 
I don't care if you heard me. Did you come here just to hurt my feelings? No, I came here to find something. Well, there's nothing here for you. I tell you to leave, but that's against the rules. I'm gonna go look for whatever case holding, hiding. Come talk to me once you're done breaking the sending's rules. That sounds like fun. Uh, right now, I'm gonna drop a save. Future Andy, edit this out. Oh my god, my ass. Alrighty. Jump off the bridge, break the rules. Where's the bridge? Broke a rule. Okay. Said jump off a bridge. You're not allowed to go any further. It's against the rules. But where you're sitting is okay. Well, it's not against the rules. And the rules are here to keep us safe. So I'm not breaking the rules. I'm safe. Sounds logic. Well, I'm going to break the rules. Oh, flip. You broke the rules and nothing bad happened? That's awesome. Wait a minute, are you Solve? Nora's son? Oh yeah, I am. I recognized you from the painting in your mom's house. You've come from Silver Pine, I take it. There's not much to say about my mom. She gave up on me, so I gave up on her. I need a minute. Uh, we gotta find Raiko. I think she's over here. Maybe in here. No, she's over here. Are you finished breaking those rules? Yeah, and I guess I found Nora's son. What? He, is he okay? I mean, he's talking, but otherwise he's seen sign. Well, that's clearly what Kay is hiding. Although, that's much more evil than I thought. I take it Jake is looking after him. I thought Jake was with you. He's not. I wonder why he didn't follow us up the ladder. Look, let's just find a way out of here. I bet Nora's back by now. She'd be dying to see Solve. Why not ask Solve where the exit is? I just discovered this monstrosity in front of us. It's a dead vault. So I need a few more minutes with it. I saw how to leave Dead World. Is there a way out of here? Maybe, but trust me, there's no reason to go back to Silver Pine. They won't even know you're gone. Convince Solve Sora, Nora, Sol, Sora. Convince Solve Nora never gave up on him. I cannot talk, apparently. That's fine. Okay, so. You have to collect Sid's lanterns. Um, I know. It would be great. Okay, here we go. Yeah, I hope everyone is enjoying this. I'm probably going to break this up into a couple parts. Uh, uh, just because this is turning into a very lengthy video. Right, can I just go down here? Yes, I could. Holy shit, that's so much easier. Look at these lanterns. Aren't they rubbish? Read it. Oh, it's from my mom. How many do you have there? I found six. I see them floating down the river every other day. They were all from her? Every last one. Okay, I was wrong. She never gave up. We're getting out of here. I'm gonna distract Glumpy. And you, you rip up the garden. It's Glumpy's favorite thing in the world. But be careful. I want them to be able to replant them. I'm sure Glumpy knows the way out. We just need to make them really mad and they'll tell us. 
Okay, let's do it. I am so, I'm gonna feel so bad about this. I legit already feel bad. I feel so bad. I would be upset if somebody ruined my garden. What in dead world? My beautiful garden. I feel really bad. Me too. Did you put him up to this solve? Sorry, Glumpy. Today, I have lost two of the three things I love. The ultimate rule. The one that protects my garden. Broken. Take my key. Inside these buildings, there are three switches. Activate them and you can all leave. I've had enough. Oh, I don't feel good about this. But we got a key out of it. Activate the three switches. So. I assume I have to go in here. Let me talk to Glump. Uh, solve. We loved you, nurtured you. Aw, I feel bad. We really wanted to return him, but she wouldn't let us. There's still some power left in that dead vault. She used it on us. Who is she? I can't say. I want to. There should be another building, mayhaps. No, fuck. I think once you keep back going past the crack, it uh, breaks. Or you lose uh, uh, control. Actually, hold on. What is that? Look behind you. Not as dumb as I thought. Sorry, I wasn't that much help in here. I forgive you. Now that we've got solved, we can go back to Silver Pine and confront Kay. I'll miss you too. I won't miss you. Don't say that, Glumpy. You are so miss solve. Alex was very careful. We'll be able to replant the garden in no time. I'll miss you, solve. So will I. Thanks, you two. I knew you loved me more than that garden, Glumpy. And your rules. Hm. Why don't you two come with us? It's a lovely thought, Sof, but we can't. Not right now, anyway. Sof, let's get out of here. Alex, do you go first? Woo, back in Silver Pine. I'm gonna go eat so many sweets. Oh, come on. Is anyone ever going to ask me if I actually want to be teleported? Alex, you're here. Jake, where have you been? I've been here? Where's that? Elsewhere? Are we still in Silver Pine? 
My best guess is we're somewhere deep in the vault. I've been so... So what? So bored. When did you get here? I don't know, an hour or two ago? Yikes, I know. When you two were climbing a la the ladder, a red sending, it took Stanley's book and moved me here. How did you get here? I was leaving Dead World and, well, the moment I got back to Silver Pine, Ascending sent me here. Ah, I see. So much has happened. We found Solve. You did? That's incredible. Where was he? Dead World. Dead World again. Was that the place up the ladder? Yeah, I'll tell you all about it. That sounds great. Are we trapped up here? If all three bits are missing, shouldn't we be trying to get back? Wait, did you just say all three are missing? Yeah. Silverfine is in some real trouble this time. But I tried and I couldn't find a way out. What are you looking at? Wow, it's incredible. How long can we survive up here? Forever, I think. This place, elsewhere, it's self-sustaining. I was worried about being stuck up here alone before. But with you here, I wouldn't mind staying forever. You should go explore. Maybe you'll find some way out that I overlooked. Don't worry, Jake. We'll find a way back home. Try to find a way off the island. Uh, good thing there are two beds. Are you sure about that, though? Food looks delicious. Every single one of my favorite bits is here. Statues are almost always covered in moss. Did you pick both apples? Have one. You want them? I don't want them both. You have one too, obviously. Ah, uh, I give up. <laughs> we'll get off this rock soon enough. Might as well make the most of it. No way off the island. I very much enjoy this game. It's one of my favorite games ever. <laughs> And you just heard my fucking fat ass creak the chair so bad. I've been uh, recording this for like an hour and a half now. I have uh, it's starting to hurt. I'm kind of surprised this place has alcohol. I know, isn't it the best? Ah, let's listen. We spend a lot of time together now. I guess so. I feel like I know everything about you. Except, well, it feels like you still got a secret. Probably just the one. I don't, honestly. But even if I did, who's to say I know all yours? Hey, I have an open book. Are you dying? What? No. Or do you have some other kind of sickness? Something not life-threatening? A strange rash? No. Do you reckon I could jump in it? Hmm, probably not. Are your clothes dry yet? Almost. I said you couldn't jump it. You still dared me, though. It was funny. I know. Are you still illiterate? Yes, I'm reading this novel for the pictures. Although, if I keep reading in the dark, I might go blind. Now you stop asking. I'll stop asking when I find out what you're hiding. Do you have a cousin who collects who uh, who collects used band aids? What? No. Also, yuck! I'm eating. Are you addicted to sugar? Yes, probably. But only when Marge is making it. The food here is so good. 
Oh, maybe that's it. Are you the world's greatest chef? Perhaps only disguised as a muddy 19-year-old. What the flip are you talking about? I realized that was really dumb as soon as I heard myself say it. Wait, you're serious? And chapter 3, The Pathway Home. I think this is where I'm going to call it for today because my ass is hurting. Um... But yeah, thank you all so much for watching. Uh, stay tuned for some more uh, content. Bye for now.